What's up guys, Nerdy Noob here, and welcome back to another boxing video. Technically we could, con I just realized we could consider this a wine series, but it's not technically a wine series, because I'm not like, I'm not drinking any wine right now. I just already drank the wine is the problem. There's no more wine left, so it's just all gone. So it's like a regular unboxing, but it's kind of a wine series. I don't know. It's literally only a Wednesday, so what's happening right now? Anyways, in this video, we're going to be boxing in this box. It's a shoebie box that I had. I didn't know what it was, but then I saw this, and it says, it says, it says, 5, 11, 20 times 5, 15 each, total 88, 56. So clearly, I think this is a mystery box, and I think that I have an itch on my nose. I can't get the itch out of my nose, but... Um, so I think this is a mystery box of some sort, and I think I got five of them, and I think they were $15 each. And there was probably some shipping charges or something, but anyways, let's go ahead and open up this box and see what we got. There's a receipt in here. Shoo me. No protector Funko mystery box times five, five, 11, 20, 20. This is very old. <laughs> My bad. Wow, look how nicely, look how nicely they packed this though. So we are going to be unboxing five of these um, Shumi No Protector Mystery Boxes from 51120. I feel like I should take a picture before we unbox this because why not? So I think that's what I'm going to do. So pause, pause. Okay guys, I took the picture. Can you guys see my pimple right here? It's very, very big on my nose. Can you see it? There it is. There it is. There it is. Shh, cat, I'm filming. Do you want to see Cube? Hi, Cube. Oh, Cube. Oh, Cube doesn't like being held. But he almost ripped a hole in my sofa just now. Ugh, Cube. Okay, so we have five of these mystery boxes. Let's go ahead and open them up and see what we got. I don't have my knife on me, so I'm. where's my knife? I'm going to go find my knife. Hold on. Found it! Yes! I got it! <laughs> I got it. Okay, so we have five of these mystery boxes and they cost like $15 each and maybe shipping. I'm not sure because it was like $88. Ugh. Ugh. I need to focus. I'm going to focus. Okay, here we go, guys. I, I'm not going to lie. I kind of saw a little bit of it, and it looked like an anime pop. It looked like an anime pop from Big uh, or My Hero Academia. Am I right? Like that big dude. It actually is heavy. Like the big, You know the big dude with the blonde hair? I don't even know what his name is, but that big guy. Is that him? Okay, this is the first pop. What did we get? It is him. It's the All Might. Silver Age All Might. It's some kind of um, special edition, so it's a it's an international exclusive, but I don't actually know. I don't know what the actual exclusive is for. He looks a little bit metallic. -y. He kind of looks funky. He looks like he's flying like this, which is kind of a funky way to fly. So we have that pop. I don't, I'm going to put him right there. Okay, I don't even remember like what, this one's much lighter, but I don't remember what we could actually get from this box. And I'm going to focus really hard so that I don't mess this up. Okay, box number two. Oh, oh no, it's not in a pop protector. I got excited. I thought it was in a pop protector. It's not, so I don't know what it is. And knowing my life, it's probably an anime pop. The cats are playing with the boxes on the floor. Okay, what do we get? Oh, they fell. Are you okay, cats? You're okay. Okay, we got Itachi. This is another um, exclusive. And I don't know what the age. Oh, I don't know what that. I don't know what that's an exclusive to. And this is Itachi. I feel like I might have received this pop before. Mm, I can't say for certain, though, but I think maybe. You know, just... Continuing to build my anime pop collection is what really what I'm doing because why not? Okay, box number three. Okay, here we go. Box number three. This is the pop. Now, it's not in a pop protector, so it's probably just whatever, but whatever, right? Right? That's what I say. Okay, here we go. What is it? 
Oh, it's an office pop. <gasps> wow, we got the Jim Halbert Chase pop. That's cool. I was actually trying to get like this one and when he had the three hole punch, um, I think that was his Halloween costume or whatever. This is cool. Oh, I'm excited about this. So this is the Jim Halper pop from The Office, but we got the Chase version where he writes book across his face. Neat, neato, that's cool. And this is actually, that pop is in pretty good condition. I'm gonna put it here so it doesn't get damaged. Okay, we have two more pops left. This is box number four. This box is really old. Not this one specifically, just this whole box. And I'm sorry, I I'm, have been not doing a good job of unboxing in time. Okay, box number four. Okay. No pop protector. Oh wait, this is a no protector mystery box. So technically none of them are gonna have pop protectors. I don't know why I've been looking for pop protectors this whole time. Okay. Oh, I like this pop, you guys. This is the Mabel Corn Mabel. And this is, um, it's some kind of shared, it's in, this is an international exclusive. I forgot what this is an exclusive for, but she's got all the paint around her. This is from Gravity Falls, which you guys told me I should watch, but I haven't. I've watched a few episodes. Actually, I'm pretty sure I watched a bunch of episodes when um, Jackson and Maverick lived here, and we were watching episodes together. But this is actually a pretty cool pop. It would have been cool if it had the actual exclusive sticker, but I like that pop a lot. Okay, that, wow, I don't know what box this is. I should look on their, I'll look on their Instagram after we're done unboxing this, but this is not bad, you guys. This is the last box, so let's just keep our fingers crossed that we can end on a good note and get something really, really, really good. Box number five. What do you think it is? Is it something really good, or is it, like, lame? Is it lame-o? Or is it good? Okay, we we got Vegeta, and this is some kind of special. We got it's a look at this special edition sticker. It's so little. Wait a second. Wait a second. Okay, this. Wait. How do I show these? Do you see the size difference between these two stickers? This Vegeta's hella old. I actually think I have this Vegeta, and I think it's from a long time ago. Like, it's really old, and it must be really old. Look how small that special edition international sticker is. Ah, that's so funny. So funny, okay. All right, guys, that's all we got. But not bad, actually. Look, what kind of a, this was a good mystery box for $15 each. They're all exclusive. Um, okay, let's play a quick game of The Pop Is Right. I actually don't think I'm gonna do very good about this because they're all anime pops, but here we go. I'm gonna say that the cheapest pop, uh, I'm gonna say it's this one, the All Might. This is gonna be my cheapest pop because I don't really know, but like, it's like cool, but it's not the coolest. I think the second cheapest pop is gonna be this Vegeta, which is exclusive to something, but I don't know what it's exclusive to. And I think the third pop is gonna be this Itachi, and that's gonna be the third pop. And then I think the fourth pop will be the Mabel, Mabel Corn Mabel. That's gonna be the fourth pop. And then the fifth pop, I think I'm gonna go with the Jim Halbert Chase. I think I'm gonna go with that being the most expensive because why not? So this is the order that I'm doing it in and you can't see them because they're all on my lap. That was the ice machine. I don't think I can get it. I don't think. It's these four plus this one, okay. Oh my gosh, you guys, if I get the pop is right on this, I'm gonna be so, so excited. Like, so stoked. Like, super stoked. Like, more stoked than super stoked. Like, ultra super stoked. Okay, here we go. What do you guys think? Did you guys put your pops in the order? Okay. Wow, jeez. That's a close one. Okay, here we go. First pop, I'm gonna say again, is the All Might. $19, uh-oh, that's that's kind of a lot of money. I need a calculator, I'll use the one on my phone. I feel like tea when I use my calculator on my phone. Okay, $19, oh, I, I, I this isn't looking, that isn't looking so great, you guys, but we're gonna keep going. Okay, I think this Vegeta is the second most valuable. I'm starting to think this might be the cheapest. <sighs> 
$20. Oh, yes. Okay, plus $20. Okay, we're on. We're okay now. Is Do you think this... I don't know about this Hitachi, though, because I can't tell what it's an exclusive to. $40. Oh, no. We definitely, I don't think, got the pop is right, because I don't think there's any way that any of these pops are going to be more than $40. Darn it. But that's okay. That's good. Oh, I'll tell you guys... Oh, I lost it. Okay, hold on. I can't tell what this is an exclusive to. Alliance Entertainment, it says. I don't even know what that is. Okay. I don't think there's any way that she's going to be worth more than $40, so $21. Uh, nuts. Well, technically right now I still got two. I still got two right. Two plus twenty. One. Okay. What do you think about this guy? I hope this guy is worth more than 40. Dang it! 35! Dang it! Okay, so I only got all my and Vegeta are, we got them right. This one was worth 35, so we were off on the last three. That's okay. But guys, we got $136 worth of value, and I paid $88.56, which means that we got $47.44 worth of extra value. For a mystery box, that's like really good. I'm actually pretty impressed. I'm pretty impressed by this box. I have to put some pop protectors on, on at least this one and on... And this one. I'm going to put them on these two. Anytime they're worth more than 30, I put a pop protector on it. But that's not bad. Now, I didn't get any pops that I was, like, overly super excited for. But all in all, that's, like, actually not bad value. And, again, when you get a mystery box that's worth more than what you paid for, that's pretty good. So I'm going to I'm gonna say this was a win. And I would definitely say that. Honestly, I think my favorite pop is the Jim Halbert pop or even this pop. Like, they're really cool so i'm excited about about those so that's the win um somebody keeps texting me a lot of things it's chris she's like texting me pictures of her new cat chris got a new black cat which means that dana chris and i all are owners of black cats which is so crazy but her black cat is a boy and his name is I don't know what his name is. It keeps changing. It, first, they were going to call it T'Challa and then try to call it Chala for short. But then his name was really Kevin Hart. Like when they got him, his name was Kevin Hart, but Hart spelled H-E-A-R-T, not H-A-R-T. So it's kind of like a play off of Kevin Hart. Uh, but then they want to name him Boba, which as the proud godmother of the cat, I must say that I feel like I had something to do with that name because I've seen a lot of cats named Boba and I just think it's a cool name. So sometimes I think they call him Boba and sometimes I think they call him Chala and I like to call him Boba Kevin. Just Boba Kevin. I think it's a cool name. So anyways, well guys, that's all I have for you in this video. Thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, you can click the like button below, but only if you want to. And if you want to see more unboxing videos, then you should definitely check out my channel. Here's the thing. Like, I haven't been really good at posting consistently a lot of times for the past, like, two years, to be honest. But, like, I really like filming videos, and I really like posting them for you. And so you should go check them out, and there's a lot of them on there. Like, a lot. And I have a lot of boxes that I still need to open, but I haven't opened yet. But I'm going to open them soon. I'm just still, I'm just, I just need some more time. That's all. So you should definitely check out my channel. You guys, you know what's so cool? And I have to say thank you to you guys. Like, I don't know what I thought, but I thought that I was only at 67 something thousand subscribers. And I found out today that I'm at 68 something thousand. And it's like so cool. That's like so close to 69,000, which is so close to 70,000. I'm like, wow. 70,000 is so close to 100,000. That's just always been my life goal here on YouTube. So one day I'll hit it. Not yet though, but one day. And I'm so excited. And thank you guys so much for that. So definitely you should check out my channel. And then don't forget, if you... Um, oh wait, I already said that. Like you should 
subscribe and let me know what you guys thought about this these boxes they're even old but they're pretty not that bad there's a lot of anime pops i feel like i should just start collecting anime pops because i'm really good at it but let me know and did you do good on the pop is right there's so many questions i have right now so you can just put all your answers down below and then don't forget if you subscribe to my channel and your subscriptions aren't blocked or set to private, you'll make it on to my thank you to subscribers page, which is coming up shortly. Before we go, we must do the video shout out. The last video, I knew who I was going to give the shout out to because they asked for one, but this video, I'm not as uh, sure. I'm not as certain, but oh my gosh, today I'm going to give the video shout out to... I'm going to give it to Simone E. Simone, <laughs> you've been on this channel forever, and I just, and you, like, comment on a lot of my, like, all of my videos. So, Simone, I'm giving you the video shout-out. Thank you so much for watching, commenting, and supporting my channel. I truly appreciate all of your support, and over, like, the years, you've just supported me for a long time, so I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're staying safe, and I want to give you the video shout-out. So, shout-out to you, Simone E! Shout-out to you! All right, guys. I hope you have an amazing day, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.